to the next dimension. Hello guys, I'm the Cover Dudes, all the way from down, and as you can see here, a bit of Call of Duty 4 gameplay, somehow, somewhere I'm going to be using the Scorpions, because that is kind of the thing, because Drifter, the guy I was talking about in my last COD 4 commentary about big YouTubers, he said, why didn't you pick up the Scorpion, I was just like, because I love my M4, and the M4 was boss, so kind of like, not to not say, like, suck up to him, but in a way, just kind of say, alright, I'll use the Scorpions, I'll try him out, I'll play a bit of a game with the Scorpion, I'll get some gameplay. I don't have the gameplay in front of me right now, but it's probably going to be awesome because I only want to put the best gameplays on my channel. This is kind of like a follow-up of what I did on the how to do, like not how to do, but why big YouTubers should do more dual commentaries to help people. Now, during that drifter, he actually liked my video and found that video in the process. A very, very, very rare thing for big YouTubers like him. He's got like 80,000 subscribers to find me. I, I've only contacted him once or twice, so the fact he actually found me is a very, very, very rare thing. I'd like to thank you for that. I got m many more views. I think I got like 20 subscribers that day, and it really, 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 really helped me. So, today's going to be kind of like a, a bit of a follow-up, and it's something I kind of found out with Drifter's liking, how many people can get more exposure via just liking and favouriting. Now, I said dual commentaries, they do a lot for a person's channel, they do a, a lot, a lot, a lot, but it takes a lot of time to set up. Getting a dual commentary ready, it took me, it takes us a long time, if you're ever going to try one. I tried to do one with um, First Caro 365, aka Caro Saturn, we just didn't do it in the end because it was just really, really, really hard to set up. So do a do, to do a dual commentary, it takes a lot of time, a lot of planning, what are you going to say, what are you going to talk about, and just in the end, you know, if you don't get it right, it just doesn't work. Now, through Drifter liking my video, I seen that, you know, it can happen through other ways, and other people's videos as well, not just mine, he likes other people's videos as well, and that's a very, very rare thing in this community. One I've got pulled up right now on one of my tabs, I'll go into my history right Right, so now is one that Drifter liked, and it got 780 views, this guy, 29 likes and 1 dislike. And he talked about Easter, Hutch, and big commentators, and the Modern Warfare 3 sniping commentary. Now, he got 780 views on his channel, his name is Frozen Swipe. Now, I haven't actually watched a video, I just saw the, the views and stuff. But then I went to his channel, and very, very surprisingly, he only had 60 subscribers. And he generally only gets about 40, 30 views per video. So Drifter's liking of that video got him a boost. Let's do some simple maths. So, for, so let's say 40, he got him about 740, 750 views. That's crazy. That is ridiculous. And I bet he got a lot more subscribers from that one video. Fact is, people that are big, that have heaps of subscribers, liking the videos does a lot. They don't know how much it does for the other person on the other side that made the video. They're thinking, alright, they might get, you know, 10 views or something because, because you know, not many people check their feed and stuff. But heaps of people, heaps of people check their feed. If you link it to your Twitter and your Facebook and stuff like that, and when you like it, people can see that as well. So it's really, really, really crazy how much these likes and favourites can do. Another example, Tuhu Sniper 98 one of, you know, not a big combat arms commentator, but he makes lots of content, heaps, he keeps turning out heaps of content, just heaps good gameplays, heaps good commentaries, and I don't know how he does, he makes like six videos a day or something, it's like crazy, and I only make like one every two days, so you know, he's a really, really good commentator as well. Drifter liked his video, his video because he started a Modern Warfare, not Modern Warfare 3, a Combat Arms, Drifter did a Modern Warfare 3. He's starting the Combat Arms in-depth series, so all about the movement, all about everything he's making an in-depth series for, for Combat Arms, which is something we really need, and the fact is I don't have the time to do it, so I was thinking about doing that, a, you know, a couple months ago, but I just didn't have enough time to invest in Combat Arms, but he, you know, he's got the time, he's doing it. Drifter found his video, he liked, and he got a boost in views as well. From, I don't know, usually it gets maybe 100, 150, 200. It boosted up to 3, 400. Now, because it's combat arms, you know, it wasn't as a, as a dramatic increase as Call of Duty. But he still got more views, which really, really, really helped him. I think he got more subscribers that day. I think he got like 17 subscribers or something. So, you know, it kind of pushed him, which is really, really, really good. 
It needs to know this for countless, countless people. Just going, you know, in between uploading, just going around, that he found a video, he likes it, you know, gave that person a bit of a shout out in a way, without making a dual commentary. And that's a thing big commentators, big people in the community have to do more. And I kind of hinted on this in my last commentary, but I want to go into a bit more detail, like I'm saying right now. Take an example, let's say, oh, let's say Woody's Gamertag. I just pulled out random. I was watching one of his videos earlier. Woody's Gamertag. Let's say he liked the video, which he doesn't. He does not like videos on YouTube. And the fact is, a lot of people don't like videos on YouTube. And I'll talk about that later. He likes a video. He likes a video, whatever it is, he likes it. And that person will get an incredible increase of subscribers. 760,000 subscribers the last time I checked that Woody had. Now, of those subscribers, I'd say a good third checks their feed and the, mo the rest has the uploads on it. It could be, it could be more, it could be less. But I'd say a good three, four, five thousand people would watch that video. Maybe more depending, you know, and depending on the day, depending on the content. But a lot of people would go on that person's channel and all he did was hit like, was hit favourite. Very, very simple stuff. And the fact is, I don't know why people do this more. It's a simple act. You hit the like button. It's easy to do. You can find somebody, hit the like button. You're not just, you know, you know, making yourself look good by liking someone's videos, you know, helping someone out. But they get such an influx of people watching their videos. It's literally crazy. And the fact is, I don't know why people do this more because, you know, it's just going to help the community much more. Get heaps. There's millions upon millions upon millions of people that watch YouTube every day. And there's so many commentators like me, you know, like Two Sniper, you know, I, I could go on forever and ever. Just there's so many people who are unknown, unknown in this community, don't have a big subscriber base. You think undercover you have nearly 2,000 subscribers, but it, that isn't really big. Big is like 10 to 20,000. And you, and if a big commentator, one, two, three big commentators or big people on YouTube like a video, it's just going to get a massive influx of people, you know, going to that video. Another example I'll pull out of my hat, Ray William Johnson. He liked the video where a person just talked about how he talked to Ray William Johnson on Skype. That video got about 100,000 views in less than an hour just because Ray William Johnson liked it. So people liking videos, it's a major, major thing. And the fact is, you know, if more people did it, more people will become bigger and help the community. But, you know, it's all up to the people that have the power. And, you know, it's their choice. And if they don't do it, they don't do it. Bye for now. It's Undercover Dudes. Alright, from Down Nutter.